time Welcome to a show about death I'm gonna need some help It's Monday everyone The sun is shining The cinemas are open And we are getting back in The cinemas are open the cinemas are open! It's showtime, baby! Yaya! This, ladies and gentlemen, is what we've been waiting five, six months for. The cinemas are finally open again. The Cinema Vlogs are back. Ryan Job 62 trademarking that name. Cinema Vlogs, Cinema Invasion. This is our first official vlog of 2021. And what better movie to go and see than Peter Rabbit 2. Now, I have said the first movie was horrible. I'm pretty sure I put the first movie in my worst of 2018 19 movie list. Remember, I did a list of worst movies, and I'm pretty sure I put that on the list. Now, this movie, of course, has James Corden in it as Peter Rabbit. You might know him better as Bustopher Jones in Cats. It also has Rose Bryan in it, I think her name is. She was in Bad Neighbors with Seth Rogen. The guy from Star Wars, General Hux, is in this movie as well as Thomas. There's also some voice acting in this, in this movie from Daisy Ridley. That is Rey from, of course, Star Wars movies. Hayley Atwell does one of the voices as well in this movie. And there's someone else. Uh, Margot Robbie does one of the voices as well in this movie. So I'm hoping that this movie is better than the first. Because I did not like the first one. Okay, there was some funny moments in the first one. But not really a lot to, you know, hook me. Um, and be like, yeah, no, I love this movie. I, I put it in my worst movie category. So I'm hoping the second one will be better. Because obviously I've reacted to, you know, the teaser trailer, the official trailer, and the final trailer I think I reacted to. So, you know, the trailers, they seem promising. Promising isn't always good, though, so... The good news is it's a nice day for a movie. It's a nice day and the cinema's open back up. Now you'd be expecting, you know, cinema's open back up, it's raining, it's pissing down, but nope. It's a nice sunny day and I'm heading down. Uh, I'm booking my tickets online now. I'm not keeping the physical version of my ticket like I used to. Just because that was so 2020, 2019, everything's digital now, so I think Keep the digital copy of your ticket and you'll be doing much better than you were last year. So this is our our first movie back. We've got Mortal Kombat. I'm trying to do it tomorrow, but if I need to move it, you know, a day later, I might. But it's so far right now it's scheduled in for tomorrow. But yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, it's time to go see Peter Rabbit. Hope I'm really hoping, you know, it's better than the first. We'll go this way. We'll go across the field and through. I'm hoping it's better. Fingers are crossed that this movie is going to be better than the first. Because the first... Yes, okay, there I admit there was an emotional scene in the first movie. There was an emotional scene. In the first, it was kind of the ending of the movie. I admit, I cried. That was it. You know, I, I cried a lot of movies, but I didn't think a rabbit would make me cry. And also, the Eternals just dropped an official teaser trailer just before I came out there. I did react to it, and that will be tomorrow morning's video. I would have done it. You know before this video but I'd already did the outro and everything so I didn't want to mess it up so that will be tomorrow morning's video so guys I will uh I will see you after this movie 
I'll give my small thoughts on it, but you are getting a job of review ski out of this movie, so I'll give a small review and more details on the job of review ski after the movie. So I will see you very shortly. And no, I'm not doing the end credit prediction game. That, bless you. Pretty sure that bird just sneezed. The, the end credit prediction game is not my thing, so I'm not doing it. No. No, I mean, I would, but it's it's not my thing to do it. So I'm, I'm, just, I'm just not doing it. I didn't do it on my own before, so I'm not doing it on my own now. There's no point. There's no point doing it alone. Don't get me wrong, I will stay, you know, if there's credits and stuff, like a mid-credit or a post-credit scene, but I'm not playing the game. It's not a game you play on your own. Safe to say, ladies and gentlemen, Ryan Job City 2 not, not impressed. The movie was fine. It was emotional, yes. Was there some comedic parts? Uh, not as much as the first. The movie was only an hour and 33 minutes long. That I'm not really a fan of. I feel it could have been longer. It felt rushed. This movie felt rushed. Was I happy to be back in the cinema? Hell yeah. Back in the recliner chairs. Oh, but watching this movie, I was like... Uh, I don't know what the correct word is for it. Rushed is one of them. But Daisy Ridley wasn't credited in this movie, even though it says it on Google, but we all know that Google lies. Google lied to me. They said that this, uh, Daisy Ridley was in this movie, but I didn't recognize her voice. I recognized Hilly Atwell right away. And... At first, it was hard to recognize Margot Robbie, but whenever the com like the description came up or the credits came up, I was like, "Oh yes!" And there is there is a mid credit scene. I didn't stay for the post credits. So there probably is one, but uh, my battery is on the uh, on the blink of dying, so I can't exactly you know stay behind and then put this little section off but overall the movie was watchable I, I will say that the movie was definitely watchable would I see it again see these are things that I'll go into in my job of review ski but no it was not something I would watch again. It was too rushed. Certain things were rushed, certain plot lines were rushed. Characters weren't really developed, I feel. Now, a bit of... bit of a breaking news about Mortal Kombat. I'm debating whether or not to push it to Thursday. Because I get paid on Thursday. And, you know, I'm looking to, you know, get popcorn. I got popcorn there tonight. But I don't know about tomorrow. So, if I need to, I will push the... Um, I will push Mortal Kombat the Thursday. It's not affecting... The upload schedule in any way it's just changing just changing the video pretty much from a Tuesday to a Thursday so you're still getting it it's not like I'm just like now nah, you know what you're you're not getting it at all it's just moving from a Tuesday to a Thursday 
Well, ladies and gentlemen, the vlogs are officially back. The birds are chirping. I'm pretty confident I just stepped in shit. But the vlogs are back. This is what we wanted, ladies and gentlemen. This is what the channel was missing. The vlogs. And now, they are back in all of their glory. The vlogs were a huge part of this channel. And now we're kicking the door down, stepping back on high ground, saying, look at me, cinemas. Ryan Job 62 has returned. So tomorrow, tomorrow morning, as I mentioned, you will be getting the Eternals um, reaction video to the teaser trailer. And then we'll see what way the... Shut up, birds. Not now. Mm. We'll see what way uh, Mortal Kombat plays out. But to say the cinema vlogs are back feels so good to say Peter Rabbit 2 better than the first one up for debate we'll go into more detail on that in my job of review ski but ladies and gentlemen we're gonna end it there we're back we're back and better than ever cinema vlogs are going nowhere